Hello everyone, welcome to another day in Shroud of the Avatar. Uh, now today we're in game with Skeggy Media, and we're in South Longfall Wetland. Uh, it's only a two tier zone, so should be available for any of you wonderful adventurers out there. Now, where do we find South Fall Wetland? Right, so if I bring up the map on the desktop, see that we're down just outside Airy, and to the right of Airy is South Longfall Wetland, which of course is right down in the southeastern tip of the mainland of Novia. So that's where you can find South Longfall Wetland not to be mistaken with South Longfall Road. And in here there's a witch's hut and um, somewhere in the hut there is a recipe, recipe to be learnt. So if we bring up the in-game map uh, we can see that Maybe not north exit here, even though the road shows here. Um, there's some interesting items in this zone, and uh, there is another puzzle, I think, in a castle there. But uh, got plunderers for Tiller there, so some interesting things in here. There's a shipwreck, which I think is there, yep. The place we need to head to is just up here. The witch's hut. So let's get ourselves angled. That's good enough. Now let's see how powerful this poison is because there's some poison here which we could try and navigate, but I think I just want to see how strong it is. Let's see if we can run through it. Probably might be able to run through it, but just be prepared, you know, to give yourself some time. But we will probably find some crocodiles and such like in here. And you probably can run round this to avoid a lot of the poison. But if we just take a break each time, just let our health come back up. We can buy a bit of health. What we've got here? Oh, salt deposit. But we've got a crocodile here, so let's just deal with him. So you can see it's of course pink skin the crocodile. Let's see what we get off the crocodile. Got a normal crocodile head. Oh, I did get, get a crocodile carcass. And let's quickly mine the salt things we're here. Salt's used, of course, in cooking. And let's carry on through. Oh, silver deposit. Something new to me. Silver deposit is sitting on the floor there. Oh, it must have been in here before because I've got a mark on the map, not unless it's just come up. There we go, that is the witch's compound. So let's head on in. Those are these bone chimes. That you can craft in the games, in the game, or oh, crocodile. Let's head on in. And you might find the odd occasional zombie and skeleton in this area as well. Let's go and have a word with the witch first.
see if she's got any help. Hello. Quickly sweet speak before I shriek. We've got a witch. A witch is clearly what I call myself. I am here to avoid every man and elf. I have been known to trade off often with elves in my glade. Uh, does she want any help? No. I think that's all she's going to say. So, and I have tried saying book and everything else to it, but that didn't work. So, let's go and have a look around because the notes on the quest say that it's hidden somewhere. And just around the back of her house, other than being, as I say, not occasional archer. Which, as you can see, very simple to deal with. If you look in the back of the hut. So it's a back entrance, so let's head in. There's a chest over here, which I've never found anything in. Now this chest is normally locked, so it says we've got to find a key. So, if you hunt around you can find the key, and if you want to find it yourself you can. Um, but of course if you want to carry on with me, I'll just quickly show you where the key is. So you can unlock the chest. And the key, after much, much searching, and if you look very closely, you might see it's actually in the fire, which is Wetland's key. If we turn the fire off, it might stand out a little bit more, but... So we get that. She doesn't seem to be worried about us finding her key. Let's head back around back of the hut, the other way probably is easier. And then if we use the key on the lock, that should unlock it. And if we open it, we can find that's the what we were looking for, the recipe, which this particular character can't do because it requires level 80 carpentry. But you could sell them on vendors and such like. And of course you get some other items. So that is how you get your log home recipe. And I hope you found this video helpful and informative. And of course you can see on there, uh, you can follow me on Twitch and subscribe to me on YouTube and that will help me grow the channels and also feel free to leave any comments in the comments area and I will get back to you. And thank you for watching.